Music is a fine immortalizer of poetry, a song that comes to us pulsing not only with faultless rhythm and true sentiment, but with concord of sweet sounds we never forget. Today's poet, Mary Stanley Bunce Palmer, was born in Beaufort, South Carolina in 1810, the daughter of Reverend Benjamin M. Palmer, D.D., who was at that time pastor of the Congregational Church in Beaufort. Mary S.B. Palmer, now Mrs. Schindler, wrote, at an early age, I became sensible of something within me which often brought tears to my eyes when I could not for the life of me express my feelings. The darkness and loneliness of our vast forests filled me with indescribable emotions. And above all other sounds, the music of the thousand aeolian harps sighing and wailing through a forest of pines was most affecting to my youthful heart. Miss Palmer was not only reared in a fine social atmosphere, but enjoyed in her own home the most careful and judicious culture. Both her gentility and her deep soul are evident in her poem, The Morning Star of the Spirit. When evening steals o'er me with silence and gloom, and night flowers are breathing their fragrant perfume, then softly retiring and kneeling alone, I may ask heaven's mercy for the hours that are gone. The bright stars may spangle the blue vaulted sky, and dearly I love them, gay dwellers on high. But the night of my soul would be starless and drear if the bright morning star did not shine on me there. O oh, star of my spirit, thy soft polar ray can warm me and cheer me and brighten my way, for earth's deepest pleasures seem changeful to me, like the gay dancing sunbeams that shine on the sea. Out of the darkness, radiant with light, shineth her brightness, empress of night. As granules of gold from her lofty height, or cataract bold, amazing sight, amazing sight. jewels on every side, lighting the joy bells, lighting the joy bells of Christmas tide. Piercing the tree boughs that wave in the breeze, painting their shadows among the sea foam that flies in the air when tossed from its home in waves so fair silvering all clouds that darken her way as she lifts the shrouds the shrouds 